Hello and welcome back to Binding of Isaac. Let's continue trying to unlock the chest. I have installed a mod which will uh, hopefully make these runs smoother and definitely makes things easier on me. Hourglass slows enemies down for 8 seconds. Cool. I don't know that I've done a darkness run like this. Is it gonna stay like this? Oh. Wait, what? So, this mod that I installed breaks my Discord. I don't know how they're related at all. But, uh, it definitely does. I thought I shut down Discord. I definitely logged out, but apparently that wasn't enough. Okay, I used the task manager to uh, take Discord on a little ride out into the country. And hopefully, we'll be good now. Anyway, as I was complaining, I wonder if uh, this darkness is going to persist for the entire run, or if it's just this floor, or what's up? I don't have any keys yet, do I? All right, well, uh, I just, I have a feeling that I want to go down before I go up. Actually, come to think of it, I want to go into that cursed room. I really have no reason to be worried about my health right now. Get a cat. Ugh. My cat is now in the habit of attacking the screen ever since last episode, or two episodes ago, actually, I guess it was. Shiva, no, down. It was, uh, it was really entertaining and cute that time, but it's, uh, it's getting old fast. Hey, no, down, get down. Jesus. Okay, uh, much like this darkness is getting extremely old, Extremely fast. Okay, so I guess I could just look at the map instead of checking the walls like that, but uh Don't at me That's what the kids say these days, right? Aha, okay, so yeah, I was, I was thinking about, like, do I want to use it on the shop or the chest, but I don't really have the gold to fuck with the shop yet. Sort of do now, sort of. I don't know. I like to at least have, like, 15 before I fuck with the shop, because from what I've paid attention to, that seems to be about yeah. the, like, upper limit of what things cost. Alright, uh, so, boss to the left, anything else in this floor? No. Boss it is, then. Oh, man. Yeah, it's kind of horrifying to do a boss with this lighting mode. Who knows what I will step in. Growth hormones. Damage up, speed up. Okay. Oh, I look so pretty. What is. <laughs> well, what's on my chin there? I'm sure that's just lumps like all the rest of them. I'm sure that's not. Not anything else. Well, I guess nine coins is what we've got to do the shop, but as I say that, I realize that there are no other keys on the floor, so... Yep, okay. 
I suppose I could break these poops and see if there's anything in them. I don't actually know if Larry's poops are the same, like RNG as the other ones. Like, they can still drop things the same way. Makes some sense that they might not, since they're infinitely occurring, but I could really see it going either way. way to read the bestiary in game, is there? No, I don't think so. I gotta back out to see that, which I guess it would save, right? Because that's how it works. I apologize if this just wasted our time, but I'm pretty sure that continue is gonna help us here. I wanna see what, uh, that? Yeah, I wanna see what those things are actually called. It's a gaper. Okay. Cool. That makes me think of Goatsy, and I feel like that is something that the author of this game would very much appreciate his game having done to me. Alright, let's go back up to the gold room now. Bob. Bob's brain. Throwable bomb familiar, the explosion deals 60 damage. Explosive thoughts. Throwable. Oh. Weird. Okay, so I guess it's just a. Like, that just moves whenever I hold down a, like, button to shoot, like, a directioner. Hmm. I'm guessing that when it collides with an enemy, it, it must explode. It doesn't explode on, like, pots and stuff, does it? No? Okay. Chocolate milk. Okay, let's blow up some flies. Okay, cool. When does it come back? Once per room, I bet? Anyway, uh, chargeable tears... Oh, never mind, there it is. Up to 400% damage slows me down, though. Uh, I don't think I actually want that. I'm not a huge fan of the chargeable tears. Oh, shit. Yeah, that explosion is, in fact, dangerous to me as well. That's fine. That's fine. I don't think I really wanted that item. You know, as I was installing this mod, I was actually I was looking at other mods, and I saw Bob's Brain mentioned. I'd never gotten it before, but I saw it mentioned in the uh, the text of another mod that was uh, it, it lets you like whitelist and blacklist certain items so that only things that you want to play with will show up. Which uh, I feel like if you go overboard with that, it would really become like what I would feel like was cheating pretty fast. Ooh, laser attack. Oh, I love that. Oh, it just keeps, that's awesome. It stays on. I love that. Um, but I can see why, uh, why someone might blacklist Bob's brain. It was one of the like specific items mentioned that, like the, the, the description was saying, like if you don't want items such as, Wow, I need some damage up for this laser. It's not really uh, doing a whole lot. Kind of neat, though, how it's like a... Kind of like a tracking laser. 
like a, a sight laser, except that it does damage too. What's that? Cancer, tears up. <laughs> Yay, Cancer! What a sensitive and respectful game. I kind of like it. So I have a key. Six coins, I don't know. Um, Diamonds? No, no. Key duplicator. Well, should I use my bomb to get more keys? Will one bomb even make it? Okay, this is a double rock here, so I think if I put a bomb here, it will let me yeah, get in there. I'll take the card. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do the boss. Maybe he'll drop some gold. Widow. Spawns one of each kind of pickup. Okay. Cool. Oh wow, it really means one of each kind. A card, a trinket, a pill, everything. Okay, uh... Well, I guess I'm gonna duplicate my keys now then, so that I can take death with me. I... Retrovision, it was cute the first time, and now I kinda hate it. What does Monkey Paw do? Half a heart spawns a black heart, three time usage. Interesting. What exactly is the downside of that? Like, how is that a monkey paw? How is that flipping a wish on me? I don't know. Anyway. Two of spades. Let's go, uh. What do I. <laughs> Retrovision made it so I can see what I have. But, uh, eight coins, okay. Still a room that I haven't been in, and maybe some coins in this? Nope. Oh well. That, that works for me. Broke even. Uh, I guess I've got plenty of keys, so... Might as well open the shop. The real question is, do I want to do the shop or do I want to do the arcade? I guess first I want to do this uh, room that I haven't done. Oh, am I wearing the box? <laughs> I didn't expect the box to affect my uh, my sprite, considering its its effect is nothing permanent. Wow, the laser really does well on fire. All right, well I got an extra coin. I guess that's something. Um, so if I go into the shop like this, chances are I'm just going to be able to maybe like buy like a soul heart or something like that for five or maybe like a bundle of keys or something. So let's, let's go to the arcade instead. Wait, shit, that was a different run, wasn't it? This isn't an arcade, that's a battery that's being shown on my map. My bad, I thought that was an arcade. That made no sense, logically, but... Since I've been in the rooms on the whatever, it's fine. Let's go to the shop. Okay. Unidentified pill. Mm. I could try re-rolling. What 
you got for me? You got any money? No. Alright, I don't think I'm gonna get anything out of that. I gotta say, I really do like this box. It's very stylish looking. Yeah, I like how the laser pierces, too. That's pretty cool. Fuck spiders, man. Okay. What do we got here? It can be like that, is it? I mean, I know it's blocked, but the sprite doesn't appear to be showing it as blocked. Kind of, uh obnoxious just like that injury was the Lud Lud Ludovico technique controllable tier I don't think I want that. Contagion. First killed enemy in the room will explode and poison all nearby enemies. Um, I'm not crazy about that. What else you got? Mega tears. Damage up, tears down. I, I'm not feeling that one either. What else you got for me? Ball of tar, chance to shoot a slowing tear. Eh, okay. Only since I'm out of shit. Man, I am a monstrosity to look at. Hmm, okay, so... Two keys, that usually means a... Oh. I, I thought it usually meant a library or a bedroom, but I guess not. Maybe it means a chest room, and then what's in the chest room is uh, quite variable. Wow. Such grand rewards so far. Health up. I'll take that. Luck up. Cool. Uh, shit. I don't... I mean, I want what's in those chests, but I don't have the health for it. We're in quite precarious territory, health-wise, right now. I really want to laser all those poops. It just seems like it would be very satisfying. But I don't have the bomb to get in there. And I am sour about that. Okay, pointless shop to the left. Probably deadly boss to the top. Let's do it. Oh wow, the slowing really shut him down. Well, I don't want to jinx it, but so far he's not too bad. Uh, health up, Cracker Jacks. Oh, health up plus a random pickup. That's cute. Oh, wait. What does that do? Speed up. Um, well, 
Yeah, no, I like cancer better. Okay. Uh, eh, do I go use the health on those chests? I don't think so. Let's stay alive. No! <laughs> Forever my favorite. Well, second favorite. Flaming gaper bodies. laser goes all the way across the room even outside of sight. It appears to because somehow these two fires got put out. Alright, let's see what we get over here. PhD, I don't really want that. Well, oh shit, it heals two hearts though. That actually sounds kind of good. I think I'll take that. I take it back. One lone butthole. Magician. Um, I suppose I could just use that real quick for funsies. I don't feel like saving it. Bones. I feel like I'm heading in the direction of the boss. That is a lot of fucking bomb flies. Come on, somebody blow up already. I hate these things. Okay, there's the boss. So, let's clear out these assholes and then turn around. What was left? Okay, so there's actually quite a bit left I haven't seen. I feel like it doesn't matter. Like, if it's clearing these guys, I mean, I obviously can't leave until I do, but I'm not gonna be able to get what's in the center. And of course, it's something really fucking good. Um. 
shit. I can get into here now, at least. Oh, hey. Thank you. Oh. Okay, well, I guess I can go to the shop then, why not? Ooh. More options. Two items now spawn in all treasure rooms. You can only choose one. Okay. <laughs> spawn <laughs> one blue spider per poop in room. Cool. <laughs> Yeah, all right. Let's let's go with that. Spoon! 33% speed increase. Sure, why not? Suspicious. So, I, uh, I, I asked a friend that's seen more of this game than me about these rooms, and, uh, Apparently, some of them are blue on the map and some of them are more red, which I haven't figured out yet because I, I, don't, I don't see any red or blue tint to this other than the red on the dagger, but um, some of them are only accessible if you only have one red heart or less, which I believe is the ones with the skull on them, so that's why I was never able to get into that kind of room on a uh, previous runs. I don't remember what the criteria for the other one is, but I don't really care because it's usually open. I don't feel like I need to understand it. But that's what's going on with that one. Justice. Bomb key, coin heart, yep. Justice. time to feed my cat sound so I'll be right back alrighty
might have to start streaming this or something soon instead of making videos because I'm uh, I feel like I'm really running out of things to say. I've yet to get into streaming. I, uh, I'm really not crazy about the live aspect of it, to be honest. But uh, I can't I can't say that I'm not at all interested, and I know a lot of uh, people have mentioned to me that they would like to see me do it. Maybe. this on the boss. Oh, it's Gertie, so he doesn't even move. I don't know if that's even going to do anything to him. Maybe it slowed his shots? Maybe. I guess I already have a slowing effect, though, on my projectile periodically, though, so, uh, probably really didn't do realistically anything for me. That's okay. going. I really want some more damage ups. Bandage. As an empty heart container, random chance to drop a red heart when getting hit. Well, red hearts, actually, in fact. That's cool. Ooh, devil room. Okay. Let's check this out. That's a boring ass devil room. Fuck off. What was that? Fucking spiders, goddammit. I love spiders, they're my favorite. Oh god. All the diglets. Laser actually is really helpful for these guys. Beautiful. Wow, it even tells me the sacrifice room stats. That's That's cool. That's that's great. I'm tempted to say that it feels like cheating, but I guess it's all the same difference. It's just stuff that I'd have to be getting up to look up on the Wikipedia. Laser doesn't lock those guys down. I don't think it does, at least. Does it? Maybe it does. No, I think I'm just not close enough to be triggering them. Alright, 
right, let's see our question mark block at work. Oh, I have to blow up them thing to get into one of them? Okay, well... Spider enemies no longer target or deal contact damage to Isaac. Oh my god, yes. Or... Doctor's remote. Epic fetus on demand. Controllable. Is that Dr. Fetus's remote? Bet that's what that is. No, we don't want that though. I want that. Spider love! Fuck yeah! Coming to save the motherfucking day, yeah! Spider love! You know what? I want him to break open some of this stuff over here, actually. Yeah, <laughs> perfect. A little bit more. Can you spawn spawn some bombs over here? Oh no, it sucked if you spawn bombs over there. No, well, sort of. There we go. That's that's good enough, that's fine. Didn't get anything from it anyway. String! Yes, please. Okay, so there's a shop that I can't do shit at, and then there's that door that won't open unless I've got one red heart. So, let's get out of here. Curse of the Blind. Okay. They hit their friends. I didn't know that. That's cool. Do all... I wonder if all of those blood beams hit friendly fire. Never noticed that. The last door you use stays open. Nah. Nah, I like cancer better. Fuck you guys. Hand, turns all chests into red chests. I don't really know the difference between red chests and regular chests. Uh, I think I'm just gonna stick with cancer because I really have such pitiful damage this run. Anything that's affecting my damage, I feel like I really want to prioritize. It's a lot of rocks in the middle of the room. Okay, let's go down. <laughs>
Oh, yeah, Curse of the Blind. Okay. Well, I, I guess I'll take the one that I don't have to use a bomb to get. Sad onions. Tears up. Works for me. Red patch, chance to get 1.8 damage up when getting hit. Okay. Wait, your range grows? Damage up, rage grows. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, I like that. In fact, maybe I'll even like take a hit or two here just to help that out. I suppose I want to be a little bit cautious though. Let me wait and get some hearts around first. Hey, spitters. Wow, okay, so yeah. All the blood beams are friendly fire. That's cool. Never knew that. So just downwards and then this challenge room over here. down. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, right. Curse of the blind. Damn it. Well, should I waste the coins on it? Let's just get a heart. I've got a lot of bombs. We can bomb him while we're here. Beautiful. Beautiful. You know what? Yeah, okay. Money talks. Pay to play. That means that there's a refresh in every room that has, uh, like, every shop room, I think. Works for me. Boss to the right. Let's go to the left. What are those? Is that the asteroid boss enemy? Is like a mini boss version of it? Yeah. Guess so. Go check that room. Um, there we go. Okay. Oh, right. These are bomb chests. That's a nice haul. We'll be back for that.
Oh wait, that's not the... Oh shit, boss is down. My bad. Wait, I have a refresh thing in here, don't I? Hmm. Uh, let's kill the boss first because uh, maybe there's just the tiniest chance that if I finish the boss, the curse of the blind will disappear for the floor. this like part of the song is gonna call it, like a piano part but I don't think it's a piano I don't know what that is I think that's a piano Jesus Christ finally okay so Okay, well, it didn't remove it, so uh, I'm gonna save my gold. Is there anything else to do on this floor? There's the Eternal Heart, and I think that's it. Wait, can I go up this way? Yeah, I can. Yep, that's where we're heading, buddy. Okay. Nah, I don't feel like the arcade. I'm not big on the arcades. Um, two bombs. Is it worth it? It's probably worth it. If I could double my coins, that'd be a big deal, and doubling my bombs would make up for the bomb usage, so... Probably worth it. Bad gas. Is this one? Hell yes, both of the things. Beautiful. Okay. Uh. I might spend a key on the bottom one, maybe. It might give me a return that it would balance out, but let me see what's what else is on the floor first. Well, okay, sure. Oh, the skulls are bomb things, okay. I thought I could destroy that with my tears for some reason. Oh! That wasn't worth it at all. What does no do? Very low chance for s space bar items. In item room, space bar items. Okay, so that's uh, probably active items. Okay. 
I'm assuming. Okay, boss or lots of rest of floor. Let's go explore the rest of the floor. Like that, is it? Uh, what am I supposed to do with those? Do I just have to take a hit? Does bomb break them open? No. Okay. Well, whatever then. Uh. Ooh. Data miner. When used, up, down, small amount on random stat. Okay. Random tier effect for current room. <laughs> Fucks up all sprites. <laughs> Professional wording there. Uh, Multi-dimensional baby. Follows your movement pattern. A three second delay. Tears that pass through it will split up and gain a speed boost. Oh, -ho! it even works with the laser. That's cool. That's definitely helpful for my low damage situation on this run, though it's not particularly uh, easy to use. At least, uh, like, deliberately. Oh, God. Okay, match. More bombs appear. Removes the tick. Interesting. No, I like my patch better. I wonder if my patch is doing a whole lot yet. My damage is still on one slash, but that's lame. If I go and turn on the extra HUD now. Uh, found HUD? Right? Okay, so my damage is at 2.27. Okay. Let's just watch that, see if that increases. Boy, I'm I'm kinda like I'm trying to like watch and use the baby consciously and I'm uh, just repeatedly getting hit because it's drawing my focus away from the defensive. Placing, like, focusing on my defense.
Kind of hit an awful lot there. Didn't get any rage boost. Lame. Eat it, greed. Eat my baby beans. Okay, so... Still really want to find the shop for this floor before I fuck with the arcade. Mm, I guess I could donate to the beggar. Maybe there's not going to be a shop. Maybe there's just the arcade on this floor. There's the shop. Okay. So... Yes, I really like that baby. Oh, doesn't affect your hitbox. I never knew that. I had no idea it was a cosmetic only effect. I, I actually, I assumed it affected your hitbox and that was kind of the whole point of the pill. Well, okay, uh, let's give you a couple coins here, I don't really want to give up, oh, there we go, perfect. Alright, I guess let's go play in the arcade. didn't amount to much. Uh, okay, well, I guess I'm just doubling the coins that I have then, and that's the, uh, that's the room. I could go put some coins into the beggar. Yeah, let's do that. Because I really don't want to double my coins until I'm at least at, uh, 50. Let's see what's in here first. Oh, oh, shouldn't press that yet. Wait, what just happened to my... Why did it say negative 77 to my uh, damage there? Does rage only affect the current room? Is that how this red patch works? That sucks if that's how that works. Oh, well, that's not what I meant to do, but that works, too. Alright, well, whatever then. Uh, double coin. I'm definitely going to take hits here, so we're going to watch it on this floor. 2.27. See if it increases. Uh. 
Well, there it increased. I, that, I'm like all but positive now that that's what's going on. I guess it could be good since it does seem to have a pretty high chance actually of triggering the damage boost. And it's a significant damage boost. I believe it's 0.8 every time, so that's that's huge. Almost doubling. Speed up, range up, increase shot height. Like wide shots? I don't know. Weird. Anyway, uh, yeah, it's definitely only for one room because it would have, uh, if it triggers that easily, I would have had boosts by now. So, yeah. Well, that sucks. Boo to this item. Let me uh, do a little more pretty looking. What is on my arm? Ew. Yeah, we're just gonna go with that. I feel like no Isaac with these items is gonna look good to me. Well, I'm probably going to replace that red patch with just about anything that I come across then. I don't know. I guess it's still good for this run since I am mostly struggling with damage, but still, like, just... I really thought it was building up over time. I'm really fast. I'm uncomfortably fast. Stick your head out. Come on. What is this shit? There we go. Oh wow, is that a mirror me? <laughs> Eat my laser, motherfucker! <laughs> Fast.
It's an interesting room. Interesting because it appears to be nothing? want a shop is that so much to ask Shit, that was its vomit, wasn't it? See forever, open secret room entrances on the current floor, and then mom IOU. Two mom hands come down, right? Okay. So, I'll take that. No! Oh, no! What a way to go. Well, this has certainly been long enough to be an episode. It feels pretty lame to end it here since I didn't even uh, get a win, but I guess it is what it is. Anyway, I've got this mod installed now, so uh, I'm going to keep this installed. I like it. It's definitely helpful. And uh, we'll keep trying to get more unlocked as we go.